ವೈರಾಗ್ಯ ಸಾಮ್ರಾಜ್ಯದ ಪೂಜನಾಭ್ಯ ನಮೋ ನಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರು ಪಾದುಕಾಭ್ಯ ನಮೋ ನಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರು ಪಾದುಕಾಭ್ಯ ಸುಖಾಲ ಭೈರವ conceived yesterday within myself it'll take a few months and then we will allow many of you to participate in the process of nurturing this process the temple foundations are being laid i think it's not working can you hear me out there those in india raise your hand so that i know you're hearing me okay thank you uh what's happening don't so uh as i said i must be stupid to get pregnant at this stage in my life because this will need lots of work but you know if i don't have a project and a purpose i feel like it's time to go so i have something to keep me going <laughs> so kala vairava unfolding in many ways it's going to be very exciting but uh you need uh, stability beyond sense in the sense that beyond what you think is sensible not sensible you need a stability beyond that to house something like this to experience something like this to become available and to be able to participate in these processes because you need stability we've been working on you for a long time but uh uh you are linking the sun process with the moon i mean to say you are doing the surya kriya only in the parnami days only only for the full moon you are doing surya kriya no we taught you all this so that your system will become in sync with the solar cycles if your natural cycle within the system your energy cycles become 4356 day cycle because this is the the longest loop of cycle that you can have in the human body if this happens to you you will have a stability beyond all sense in any kind of situation no matter what life or death something within you will be always stable balanced if you don't bring this within you then in many ways you will become unfit for various process of processes of life you may be available for one thing you will not be available for another thing so this in a balance is not just about you being peaceful if sufficient number of people i don't want to put the number out but if enough number of people in a space in a community in a town in a city in the world have a cycle like this that their physical cycles within themselves is running with the 4356 day cycle well all the other fools will become peaceful by themselves as ambient benefits that if one light lights up everybody benefits just like that this needs some work for many of you because some of you are doing sadhana but you don't fix the nature of your mind when i say you don't fix the nature of your mind we gave you uh three to five powerful tools in in engineering you must make this a living reality within you you thought it was a fanciful lesson why i'm saying this is <laughs> in the last couple of days uh people are uh they are always coming but something significant came my way uh, <laughs> a couple of days ago that uh <laughs> people are always uh, you know they're uh, 
like these McMinnville cockroaches in the drain, they're always nibbling at something. They nibble at something somewhere and suddenly it excites them a little bit. And they come and tell me, Sadhguru, this new teaching I found, Sadhguru, you must acquaint yourself, this is the thing you must read. I say, okay <laughs> Not because there is nothing that I should read, but I've been reading this, absolutely. About this I don't have to read anything, about that I'm willing to read. So, this is because people have still not grasped what those five simple principles were. They think it is a lesson that they learned and they forgot and they had a good experience and now they're struggling with life because now they're back to reality. Sadhguru, with his inner engineering process, had taken them out of reality, now they're back to their miserable reality. I want you to understand this, when you are out of your misery, you are touching reality of your existence. Now, you are once again a psychological case. And of course, you are changing the course of your life every few days or every few months, depending on what your cycle is, because new ideas are coming, new emotions are coming <laughs> So Kala Bhairava, you must understand, Kala Bhairava means for you, the simple thing is, you live with the background foil of your life always as death. This is not my morbid idea, this is the way creation is. Either you live in this creation or you must go somewhere else where there is no death. People tell you heavenly life is eternal. You could try 